salt and pepper one. That that's cool. Like chinchilla. A lot of black rabbits. Those black rabbits look like. Little okay, rabbits. so who do I tattoo? Who needs a tattoo? If you're gonna register your rabbit, if you're gonna show your rabbit, or if you have two litters that have the same color rabbits. Like we have a, right now, we currently have a lot of black rabbits. Now we had 11 rabbits on one litter. And then we had the other litter that had four black rabbits in that litter. So really all we had to do was just tattoo the four black rabbits from the one litter. That way we didn't have to do a lot of tattoos and um, now we can separate all, we know every, if, if, if it's a black rabbit and it doesn't have a tattoo, then that means it belongs to the one litter. So that, that's how you keep your tattoos um, down. It will, the, the first letter is the father, the second letter is the mother, the third letter is the month, and once we get to um, October, then we just put O, and November is N, December is D. Um, that way we don't have to write, you know, 11 or 12, we don't have to do two digits. And uh, so it's the father, the mother, the month, and then uh, the number for the, the rabbit. So if there's two does or three does or whatever, we'll just keep going up in the numbers. So it'd be for females, it's um, even numbers, and for male, Here. it's odd and numbers. And I can grab a rabbit and I can pull it out, and we can look it over, and we can see how, you know, boy, that rabbit looks black. Different. Now I can reach I can... into a different. Let's go. Let's do that. Let's go down here and reach into a different cage, unrelated rabbit. Okay, and these rabbits are even. A little younger. I think they were born about a week before. Get a black one. Unrelated. And look at look at how much. You would never know. They look the same. So, how do you do it? You tattoo them. And these tattoos are quick. They're not. We're not talking like a dragon on its back or anything like that. We're doing a one minute long tattoo. Oh, this isn't my office. We're doing a one minute long tattoo. And uh, so what we have on the table quick. is starting over here is our easy tat, pat, uh, tattoo gun. We have a shot glass with alcohol in it to dip our pen to clean it when we're done. We have pads to clean the ear with alcohol. Um, ink, of course, we have our little tray that we put ink in. And then um, before we get started, after we clean it with alcohol, we spray the ear with Gigi's numbing spray. And I'll, and I'll link this in the video in the description. Um, we just use Meyer brand ointment, triple, triple antibiotic plus. This is the same stuff I use for um, insect bites with Ross's uh, little scab. And that's really all we need. And then a, an extra towel. This is just to like get stuff from sliding around the table. And then I'm gonna wrap up the rabbit right now. underneath it. Now I'm going to clean the ear. And what we want to do is tattoo down, down the ear in the flap. And before we even get started, spray it and then we'll give it a couple minutes we'll use the magic of video to skip ahead two to three minutes
So there we go, there's our tattoo. Put a little antibacterial on it. We got JU52. So what does that say? These are the very few for there this is the very first doe tattooed in the litter for Joey, the male first, the female, Ursula, born in May, and it's a female. And it was the first one tattooed. And that's so our any system. questions, be sure to comment. Um, any ideas, anything I'm leaving out. Um, I know there's people out there that are better at this than me. So I welcome all criticisms. Um, um, yeah, and that's that. So good luck with uh, your tattoos and hope. Yeah. Yeah, anybody ever has any questions, please comment. Um, I always enjoy reading the comments and I appreciate anybody who takes the time to, uh, you know, tell me about their rabbitry or tell me what their experiences are. Um, I love talking rabbits and, and um, I love to hear about your experiences. So, until um, next time, we will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.